Hi. Um, here I'm um, going to show you how you can use repeater fields um, as the uh, contents for um, your uh, tabs and accordions. So I've uh, got this page, Amsterdam Glass, that I've been using for uh, demonstrations. And uh, I've set up uh, in my dashboard uh, in advanced custom fields the field group for uh, those locations. And uh, the location group uh, has all those uh, fields that make up the page. So and uh, now I've added uh, tab options and accordion options. So on these uh, tab options, set it up as a repeater field. And a repeater field uh, has two uh, subfields, one, co one called label and one called content. And uh, the label on the field names can be anything you like, but uh, they have to be uh, called label and content um, because those are the field names that uh, the uh, tab uh, module and the um, accordion module are going to use to um, uh, show you uh, the value that they are going to show you. So I've got these two uh, set up. And uh, also the uh, accordion has a one called uh, label, a subfield, type text, and the contents, which is a type uh, we see wig editor. Of course, we want to uh, enter uh, well uh, some text in there. Got this one uh, set up to uh, show them on uh, the location, um, custom post type. So we're going to open that up. So here's all the uh, text, company name, the address, description, gallery images for the slider and the background, the table, the payment methods. And uh, here are the tab options. So here's the label and the content, and one tab called uh, About Us, uh, one tab called uh, Our uh, Products, and one called Our History. And we've got the accordion called uh, Frequently Asked Questions, Support, and the other one, Contact. So uh, got this one saved already. So uh, let's um, add those options. Okay, as you can see, uh, it's applied by a location singular uh, theme layout. So I'll just open that up when that uh, that's uh, loaded in. We're going to add the uh, tabs over here and the accordion uh, back here. So pull in the uh, tabs first. They're going to show me uh, item uh, one. And now, because I've added the connections uh, uh, parameter on the tabs module, I can click on it. And it's going to open up my, uh, uh, my connector uh, selector. And I'll choose uh, the toolbox field. And I'm going to choose the repeater field. And uh, up here, I'm going to select the tab options field. I'm not going to use one of the subfields. I'll just uh, take them all, anything that's uh, suggested. When I save it, I save it over here. You'll see it just picks up on all the items that I've uh, input uh, into uh, the dashboard and uh, I'll push them to the screen. Do the same for the accordion. Pull that one in. Add the connector, connect, select our repeater field for the accordion, save it, save that one too. And there you have it. Done. Publish. So let's get back to our Amsterdam and reload the page. See this right over there. It's in there. So now, if you want to add one of one uh, one tab, 
go to the tab section. I had one update. And uh, load that page. There it is. Okay, that's how you add a repeated field to the tabs and accordion module. Thanks for watching.